been taking a look at my Lego mock I made of the box. Once again, uh, this is dinner with James and it's pretty, it's pretty nice, so yeah. So the first figure we have is James Carlington and um, yeah, it's just the standard printing and face with um, an alternate expression of winking and I think it's pretty nice. Um, I actually really like it, um, but we've seen it twice now. Um, but we also have this little fork. We also have this little fork um, that he has. Uh, yeah, because I mean, it is dinner with James after all. But yeah, um, he's got some nice torso printing and some on the back as well from Lego City, as well as some nice blue trousers. This figure is strong that we also get in um, Gabby's plan set, but. Yeah, he's just the exact same, same face, um, same, same uh, torso, a bit of back torso, and it's from the Lego Ninjago line, um, Lego Ninjago movie line. If you remember that Whoops, yeah, that's fine. Um, also some nice grey leg parts there, which I'm pretty happy with. Figure is an is actually a new figure that we've not seen before. Uh, this is uh, Charlie, and he's James' best friend. I tried to get that, because uh, he's a crazy guy, I tried to get a crazy face, so I used Sandy Cheek's face. <laughs> um, it was as close as I could get, but he has, um, yeah, the nice Sandy face. He also has a fork, but he also has a knife as well, which is quite cool. Um, I just find it in my Lego box, and uh, it also has this nice torso print. Um, it's like a jacket. Uh, no one on the back, but yeah, some nice grey legs as well. And this uh, this hair piece that I like to call the uh, what are, what's it called? Um, the uh, Peter Bateman hair. Yeah, because that's where I first saw it from. Yeah. Parts this nice little stove here, which I really like, and um, it's designed um, because Strong serving them the food usually since they have the parts you can't really reach up. I didn't really think about that. But if you get like something, you can possibly do that. Um, but yeah, I like it, you know. I had some little details here, which I was pretty proud of using the jumper plates and these um, one by one cheese slopes. And um, also a little, uh, I don't know what you would call it, stove, I guess. Yeah, it's yeah, so. A uh, nice little stove here, and um, also some nice details. Um, I don't know what you would call this part, but I do have one in my kitchen, so yeah, with uh, this thing here. It also goes up to a chimney, which it was a pretty cool detail. I just uh, put these two on top of each other and then stick it on here. So yeah, that's so that. Oh yeah, and also on the back I added a little bit of grip texture here. And yeah. Up is this nice little chair. I actually really like. Um, yeah, I really like this chair because um, I mean it's nice, simple design. Literally just brown pieces put together, and you can get a minifigure on there, which is good. Uh, it fits on there nicely, like this. Yep, fits on there very nicely, uh, so we can have his dinner. Uh, yeah, and uh, two of these are included in the set, except this one's just a wee bit different because uh, I ran out of pieces, so I just, you know, I just did that, you know, it's fine. We have the table, which I'm pretty proud of as well. Um, you know, yeah, this took a while to make, but it's fine. Um, we have some jumpers as well as plates and jumpers, also a little napkin here, but the jumpers are so you can put stuff on here. It only comes with one bowl, but you can uh, use them if you have any other parts, I guess. Um, it also comes with a nice little fish here that you can put on the table. Um, yeah, and then the chairs, you can't really tuck them in, but hmm, it's fine. It's uh, supposed to be a nice uh, scene, which is, uh, yeah, I quite like. I really like this, actually. It's uh, really proud of it. So now, they can have their dinner. 
is uh, Dinner with James. I hope you liked it. Um, yeah, I'm pretty proud of it. Uh, you know, I'd rate it like a, um, a 7 out of 10. Obviously, like, just this part, really annoying that you can't actually fit over that. So I didn't really think about that, but there was no way I was going through all that just to break that because it was that, that took a long time. But I get also this chair is kind of annoying me with the OCD because uh, they're different. Yeah. But you know, apart from that, I actually love this. Um, love this little mock I made. Um, yeah. So I'll see you in the next one for a Lego set uh, mock we're using. And uh, yeah, bye.